Okay, now let's go over this right from the very start of what we did. We did this. What's the name of that class? <laughs> What's another name for it? Because that's a G, correct? <laughs> What's the name of this clef? And what's another name for it? Because that's an F, correct? Right? Okay, now we have C clefs. I have that clef, and I have this clef. This is what? And it's what? C. Little C. Beautimus. And this is? And this is. No, 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 no. You got it. Yeah. Question. Oh, uh, which instruments use the alto again? Viola. Viola. It's the only clef they play. All right. Thank you. But now I've seen in trombone music, uh, tenor clef. Well, I don't sight read it very well. But because uh, the range goes up higher, rather than writing all those larger lines above the staff, like the highest notes that I'm accustomed to reading, I'm I'm, I'm accustomed to reading that. It's a D in bass clef. It's this D up here in, in, uh, in trouble. Uh, but I can't sign read anything about that. Especially, you know, if we're talking about 16th notes, they go by so fast, you can't, you can't count those lines fast enough. So we have to move those notes down into a step so we can see better. That's what those clefs are about. Uh, cello, I play a little cello. Cello is an instrument that has an extremely wide range. The cello goes from bass clef into tenor clef and into treble clef. Junior fifths, it's C, G, D, A. So they have to have the different clefs so that they can put everything in a stack without all those silly lines up there. Tell me what a diatonic half step above C sharp. E flat. E flat. E flat. A diatonic half step above C sharp. D. 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 Hold it. Let me re ask it. I'll ask another question first, and maybe this will help some of you. What is the inharmonic equivalent of C sharp? D flat. D flat. D flat. Got that? All right. The inharmonic of C flat is D of C sharp is D flat. All right, now give me a diatonic half step above C sharp. D. D. Give me a chromatic half step above C sharp. C double sharp. C double sharp. A flat lowers the note by one half step. Right? Yes. And a sharp raises the note by one half step. Right? A double flat lowers the note by two half steps. A double sharp raises the note by two half steps. Correct? Yes. yes. Chromatic half step has the same letter name. Diatonic half step has a different diatonic D letter name. If we have a whole note, based on the two halves, four quarters, eight eighths, 16 sixteenths, 32 30 seconds, and 64 60 fourths. Correct note? Yes. Mm -hmm. no. with, with that breakdown, you can create, and also the dot that we're going to get, you can create and the double that. Ooh. You can create any rhythm that you can hear. So that's the idea of it all. 